Hi guys and welcome to Strength Universe. In mid-October 2023, Brian Shaw, Eddie Hall and Mitchell Hooper announced that they had signed a contract with Finishers Championship to compete in an MMA fight on the 17th of February this year in what was touted to be the heaviest MMA fight in history. The championship is to be held in Qatar at the Cleaver International Stadium in front of 90,000 spectators who would watch Brian Shaw against Martin Ford and Eddie Hall take on the current world's strongest man, Mitchell Hooper, with the winners of the two bouts competing in the final. Tickets were to be sold to IQ tickets and streamed via pay-per-view. Since the announcement, the strongmen have taken the fight very seriously, showing their progress as they transitioned away from strongman into MMA, improving their cardio and learning striking and grappling techniques. But most opinions are they will struggle to match Martin Ford's experience in stunt work, MMA training and his superior conditioning. Although it should be noted that Martin has never fought professionally and one punch kick or elbow from any one of these four giants could end the fight in a blink of an eye. Unfortunately, over the past 15 weeks we've seen little to nothing from the promoters. Their social media now shows zero images or mention of the fights between Brian, Eddie, Mitchell or Martin nor does the Finishers Championship website. The website does however state that tickets will go on sale via Q tickets in February, but with only a few days to go until the Championship, and no mention of the event on the Q tickets website, how on earth did the promoters expect to sell 90,000 tickets? Finishers Championship also expect 50 million pay-per-view sales and a social media reach of over a billion. But with less than a combined 2,000 social media followers, you wouldn't think that this figure could possibly come to fruition. While none of the athletes nor finishers championship have officially announced that the Strongman MMA event is cancelled, with only a few days to go and a complete lack of promotion and updates from the promoters, it seems highly unlikely that the event will go ahead. Please let me know your opinion on the event in the comments below. That's it for the video, but thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, please take a second to hit like, share the video and subscribe for more. Thank you.